Hi guys and welcome to another one of my videos. Um, this time I'm going to be talking to you about a four week mini court I'm going to be doing. Um, me and the missus are going away to New York in seven weeks tomorrow, which was a birthday gift from my missus. Uh, she paid for it all. Can't complain. Can't complain at all. <laughs> um, so we're going there seven weeks tomorrow. So in three weeks time I'm going to be doing a four week mini court. So um, on, on YouTube, on Instagram, I'm going to be keeping you up to date with my progress pictures. So I'll be sending over weekly update pictures, and my front shots, my side shots, my back shots. And you can see my body weight getting peeled off week after week, um, which is quite like fascinating to see really. Just like like from from fat guy to pretty lean in four weeks. It's because, because in a four week mini cut, you, I try to do things quite drastically. So obviously the body fat uh, will come off quite quite significantly really. Um, <clears throat> so I'll be taking you through my, my update pictures, my, my progress pictures. Um, I'll, be, I'll also be taking you through my uh, food intake, so how many calories I'll be on, um, and my macro split. Um, so normally, um, at the minute, I'm on 3,700 and 3,100. That's training days and non-training days. Um, I will admit it is getting it is getting quite hard to get them all in. Um, I'm at 208 pounds I think I was this morning which is actually as heavy as I've ever been in my last off season I pushed up to 202 so I am 208 pounds now I do feel like body composition is slightly better however I do feel like it is about time for a clean up to be fair because I'm feeling a little bit fluffy on the edges <laughs> um, as you can only take an off season so far before you have to clean it up um, so yeah I'll be taking you through my calories and um, how much I'll be dropping them by week after week what my macro split is, everything, everything, the, in, the ins and the outs really. Um, I'll also be taking you through what training split I'm doing, so maybe a five day split, six day split, depending on how I'm feeling. Um, normally my training splits don't change, um, but I might make it a little bit more intense in the last week, just, just to shed off a little bit more, just to make my expenditure a little bit higher, things like that. Um, I'll be taking you through my cardio routine and my step count. So my cardio routine at the minute is just 300 calories two times a week. That's purely just for fitness. Um, more often than not, I, I probably will keep that throughout the off-season. Like most, most people in their off-season don't really tend to do cardio at all. But you'll find that quite a lot of them, I'm not saying all of them, but quite a lot of them are relatively unfit when they come through the higher rep sets. They get gassed halfway through. And I just don't want to feel like I'm just like I'm just tired because I'm out of breath or anything like that. So 300 calories is about 20 minutes on the cross train. It's nothing. It it really is nothing. Break a sweat, get your heart rate up, get gone. Um, <clears throat> so my steps at the minute are around, they're roughly around 5k. So it's nothing. It, it it's like I'm not not taking any excess walking, um, anything like that. I'm literally just doing what I need to do in the day sitting down getting on with some work um, my step count probably I'll probably set it at around 10k um, and then just build it up from there maybe maybe even just keep it there just play around with my cardio a bit but I'll be taking you through all of that um, I'll also be keeping you up to date on how much water I'm having to keep me hydrated how I'm feeling um, everything like that my energy levels everything how good my sessions are um, so if any of you guys are interested in joining me to share the pain you can uh, email me at mitchormack at gmail.com or Facebook or Instagram um, and we can do the journey together and it's going to be hard but it's going to be worth it. Four weeks, you're in and out. You're in and out in four weeks. It's a month. That's all it is. And then at the end of it, summer's right around the corner. Chances are it'll be like 16 degrees. That's pretty much British Brit, British summer. So summer will be here and you'll be ready. Um, so yeah. Um, if anybody wants to join in on the journey, let me know and we can get to work. Cheers, guys.